We had a patient that called me one time and she was crying and she was miserable and she was in pain and she was nauseous and she started using the products. It made such a difference for her. And the patients are so sick. They don't have it in them to get through the registration with the Maryland Medical Cannabis Commission. So I make that possible for them. And we also cover the cost. The Zacking Against Cancer Cannabis Program is something that we started in 2019. I was in the office. I was talking about how much cannabis helped one of my kids who had autoimmune illness and how effective it was with um, symptoms and other treatment side effects. And we thought that it was a good fit for cancer patients. And the feedback I've gotten has been tremendous. I have patients that call me and let me know that they really appreciate it. The social workers that continue to work with the patients tell us how relieved a lot of the patients are. Their pain is more in control. They don't have the side effects with cannabis that they do some of the other products, like they get horrible constipation with a lot of the pain medication, and the cannabis helps with that. And I've really put together a profile of what kind of products to use for which ailments. And the side effects of cannabis are not as extreme as the side effects with other medications, but we never ever make any kind of medication recommendation. We always kick that back to the doctor if a patient has a question about that. With the new state law, with cannabis becoming legal, the way it would influence the Coping with Cancer Cannabis program is that patients still need registering health, product advice, and dosing advice, and financial support to be able to buy some products. For more information, you can reach out to the Zacking Against Cancer Foundation at www.zackingagainstcancer.org or our phone number, 443-319-5394.